Good morning, judges, and my dear friends. I'm Isabel from grade one, and today I'm going to tell you all a story about the rainbow fish by Marcus's sister. A long way out in the deep blue sea, there lived a fish, but not just any ordinary fish, but the most beautiful fish in the entire ocean. His scales are every shade of blue and green and purple, even sparkling silver too. The other fishes were amazed by his beauty and they called him the rainbow fish. Come on rainbow fish, come and play with us, they will call. But the rainbow fish would just glide past and prowl and fly. One day, a little blue fish followed the rainbow fish and asked him, Rainbow fish, can you please give me one of your shiny scales? You want me to give you one of my shiny scales? Who do you think you are? Get away from here! The replied the rainbow fish. The little blue fish was shocked and he swam away. He felt so sad that he told all his friends what had happened. From that day on, no one had anything to do with the rainbow fish. And now he was the ruliest fish in the entire ocean. One day, the rainbow fish poured out his troubles to a starfish. I really am beautiful. Why doesn't anybody like me? Hmm, I can't answer that for you. But if you go beyond the coral reef to the deep caves, you'll find a wise octopus. Maybe she can help you. The rainbow fish had found the caves. It was too dark inside. He couldn't see anything. Then the octopus emerged from the darkness. I've been waiting for you. The waves have told me your story. My advice to you is give a shimmery scale to all the fishes. You may not be the most beautiful fish in the entire ocean, but you will discover how to be happy. Give away my skills, my beautiful shiny skills. Never! How could I be happy without them? Before you could see all this, the octopus vanished. Then the rainbow fish fell in love. The little blue fish was back. Rainbow fish, please don't be angry. I just want one of your shiny scales. Rainbow fish thought. Hmm, only one very small shimmery scale. Maybe I wouldn't just miss one. Carefully, the rainbow fish pulled out the small shimmery scale and gave it to the little blue fish. Thank you very much, Rainbow Fish. Then rather a strange feeling came over the Rainbow Fish. The little blue fish whizzed through the ocean with this shimmery scale. And it didn't take long before the Rainbow Fish was surrounded by the other fishes. Do you all want the shimmery scale, of course? The Rainbow Fish shut his scales left and right. And the more he gave, the more delighted he became. As the water around him was filled with chimney scales, the rainbow fish fell at home with the other fishes. Finally, the rainbow fish had only one chimney scale left. Yet, he was very happy. Come on, rainbow fish, come and play with us, they will call. Here I come. He said, and happy as a flash, he's, the rainbow fish swam off, joined his friends. The moral of the story is, happiness is 
from sharing and friendship and not from half and not from having beautiful possessions. Thank you.